Yes. I ain't going along with you. Amen. I'm going to give you hell. Yes. Trying to get you all to come on that mess. Uh-huh. So this is a new generation. Ain't no new generation. Uh-huh. The word of God the same yesterday. Uh-huh. The same of God the same today. Yeah. And the same of God will be the same tomorrow. Yes, it is. We're a new thing. There ain't nothing new about the word of God. Uh-huh. You all read the book of the preacher, third chapter, each answer. Ain't nothing on the heaven is new. Uh-huh. Everything I've been able to get is the same thing every day. Yeah. Ain't that new? Uh-huh. You all been trying to dress it up, but it's been mind that it's still it's, it comes down to the word of God. Yeah. Hallelujah. Man. Hear me talking out there at the end of that word. Ooh. Hear me talking. Yeah. My life is on the line to try to help you to get saved. Ooh. To try to help you to come out of sin and give your life to Jesus My while God. you can. Yeah. Don't be like in the days of Laura. Uh-huh. They have plenty of warning. Oh, yeah. And you have a play the morning all day at the time. People are crying out against sin. Yeah. Telling young man, old man, want boys and girls to come out of sin. Uh-huh. You got old man wrapping up in sin. Y'all woman think that old woman think that they're, they're still young. Jesus. You ain't young, you're old, your body ain't gonna reflect like when you was 21. Yes. Think you can get out there and outhold the young people. Think you can outsex the young people. You can get to dry up and get up behind and repent and try to find Jesus. Yes. Got your old self up there. Think you're young. You ain't young. Pause when you're 60 years old. You ain't got no bitter somatic in. Uh-huh. You should do. Dedicate yourself to Jesus. Yes. Try to prep to bring the young girls out of sin yes. to get in Jesus. Amen. You out there try to outhold the, the, the young people out there. My Lord. Dressing up that young people with your old self. Yes. Huh? My Lord. Hear me talking. Yes. Huh? Oh, Hear me talking out there in the world. Uh-huh. My life is on the line. You got preachers in the pulpit way past. Yes. Yeah, if you're on the devil's side, you're allowed to do anything. Uh-huh. But we got the cry to let you know it's wrong. Yeah. To try to get you to get on the mess and come back on God's side. Uh-huh. God told Moses to tell the people all the time. Yes. Remember, don't, don't wear them attention to a man. Uh-huh. I don't care how, how, how the path look, but if you got on the path, you got something pertaining to what I got on. Yes. And I'm going to let you know that you're walking in abomination. Yes. That's the word of God. Uh-huh. And going to the 21st uh, chapter of Revelation, all the vulnerable things are going to live a fire and burn. Yeah. See, you, you, you only meant to live a fire if you don't change. Uh-huh. That go for my wife. Yeah. That go for the two girls I got. Uh-huh. If they were in past, they're walking in abomination. Yeah. I ain't going to overlook nobody. Amen. Because she's my wife and she went past. If you don't spread up, you want to be at the lake of fire. Yes. I'm talking about my household. Uh-huh. I've got two girls. Yes. One's a day of preacher. Uh-huh. Other one is served. They wear pants. Mm-hmm. They walk in the ball and in the sight of God. Yes. Huh? Amen. Which we, when they come out, we, we taught them it's wrong for women to wear pants. Uh-huh. People say, oh, man. Yeah, the Bible says so. Amen. Don't let these false people deceive your women. Yes. All they want is your money. Yes. If they tell you the truth, now, see, I don't care about your money. I'm concerned about your soul. Yes. The Bible said, don't women don't wear them attention to a man. Yes. And man don't put on women's garment. Amen. How would I look up your preaching God wearing a dress? Yes. I'd be uh, in abomination. Yes. Damnation to my soul. Uh-huh. Hurting myself. Yes. That's why I got to let y'all know these things. Amen. It don't make no difference who you think. It's to let every man be a liar. Yeah. You all hear what I said? What the Bible says? It's to let every man be a liar. Yeah. Please let the word of God be true. Uh, if I'm a liar this morning, yeah, I uh, yeah, but I got to let God's word be true. Yeah. I can't chip a good God's word to satisfy nobody. I got to let the word of God be true. Uh, but it's, it's, it's because God is holy, right? Yeah. His name is holy. Yes, it is. Amen. Hear me talking this morning. Yeah. Exalt you the Lord our God and worship at his footstool right. for he is holy. For it is holy. Ah. Uh-huh. Yes. It's too many plant church going on here today. Yes. We gotta be strict and tough mm-hmm. in God with you don't play with the people. Amen. You don't say, I'm gonna go forgive you, but you go to sin no more. If you go to sin again, what's the thing will come upon you? Yes. And you know what I'm joking? He healed you. 
deliver you? Yes. You go back in the same thing again, he brought you up? My Lord. He gonna say, what's the thing that come upon you? Yes.